Alright, fellas. I just had surgery last week after the hard woodsman's meet, so about all I'm allowed to do right now is uh, chill out in the garage and sit in a hammock and uh, relax the day away. But I uh, want to tell you about a company that a lot of you probably haven't heard about. Um, the guy that runs it is a, is a friend of mine, but besides being a friend, he is very, very, very good at what he does. And that company is J Leather. And I know my buddy Ranger Joe just did a video on their customer service, but uh, I wanted to add my two cents as well. Right now in my possession, I've got three of his sheaths. One is for the Turley Green River. Dangler. Stainless steel everything. His, his craftsmanship is fantastic. His edges are polished. You can almost see yourself in the leather edges. Stitching is straight. He does everything by hand. And this is just one of the small ones. Um, the dangler, you can just put it over your belt. You don't have to take your belt on and off. That's a fantastic idea. And his prices are very, very reasonable um, compared to other stuff. And the leather is much more heavy duty. This one's borrowed. And it's one of Jay's earlier sheets. Puts his mark on everything. And he wet forms it. If you send him the knife, he'll wet form it for you. And uh, if it's a Turley model, you don't have to because he is the preferred sheath maker of Turley knives. This is the newest one that I just got, and it's a monster. That's a full-size Tom Brown tracker. That's the T1. You could paddle a canoe with this bad boy. And, uh... It's just a pig of a sheet. This is the second sheet I've had Jay make me for this knife because I could not get used to the scout carry on a knife this big. It pulled my pants down. But uh, that sheath went to another buddy. And once again, the edges are fantastic. All the hardware is the best you can get. Snaps. Don't have big dents in them like some sheath companies I've seen, and just just absolutely the best of everything. His prices are more than reasonable. The only downside is he doesn't have a website yet, so you have to go to Bushcraft USA, go to down to the vendor sub forums, it's near the bottoms, and look into J, the letter J, leather. Um, get a hold of him; he'll give you a quote. He's on the site every day, and he'll get right back to you. All right. Anybody ask me about a leather sheet, um, I send them to Jay Leather, if that tells you anything. 